YouTube, it's your boy Clusive, and I'm here with my very first Q&A. And in today's Q&A, I do have the questions here on my phone from my Instagram and my Twitter. If you guys want to go follow either of those, make sure you go down below and follow me. Let's get right to it. Now, the first question is, what's, which sport do you like the most? Now, the sport I like the most is football. If you know me, I grew up playing football. I used to love watching football, the Super Bowl, best times of the year. My favorite team in football, I don't really have a favorite team. I had a favorite player. It was Odell, but I don't really, like now I'm not really into the whole football. I just watch when I could watch. Now, the second question is, who is your favorite actor? Now, my favorite actor, I had to really think about this. My favorite actor would low-key be Adam Sandler. Adam Sandler movies are just the best times. It's funny, it's inspirational. You get a real good kick. I would say one of my favorite movies of Adam Sandler is probably the movie Pixels. And then right after that, it will be Grown Ups 1 and Grown Ups 2. Those were some funny movies. And then his newest movie, the one that's on Netflix. I forgot what movie it is. It's for an inspirational movie. That is also one of my top movies of Adam Sandler. Now the third question is, how, be, how many siblings do you have? Now me, I have four siblings. I have three brothers and one sister. Me and my sister is the oldest. I have two older brothers and then one brother is younger than me. Now. Another, the fourth question is, who is your celebrity crush? My celebrity crush, I'm sorry babe you're watching this, but my celebrity crush is Jenna Ortega. She is just so fire. Her acting skills is so fire. She just fire. That girl is just mwah. I love that girl. She's so fire. You feel me? I love Jenna Ortega. That's my, that's my heart. That's my heart for real. All right. Now the fifth question is, where is your favorite place to go on vacation? Now I haven't, I've been to many places so far. I wanted to travel more, but my favorite place that I've been to in my times of traveling, it would probably be Jamaica. Cause Jamaica was so tropical, it's so calming. It was like, I was just like, I was relaxing. Like I just didn't feel like no negativity, no nothing. I was just chilling, you feel me? Like Jamaica and the girls out there, they were fire. The girls was fire. I went, I went, um, motocross riding. The pool was fire. The food was fire. The drinks was fire. The parties was lit. Everything. Now, the next question would be, what's the best piece of advice you ever received? Now, the best piece of advice I've ever received would probably be, to never give up on your dreams and if you get knocked down get back up because it's a it's really hard times you know creating videos really doing content stuff of that nature and then like you look at the views and everything the likes are you just like damn like what could I have done better to really to like really be on the up and up like my inspiration right now my motivation is probably looking at Kai Sinat you know because Kai Sinat, he really came from the bottom. Me and him, me and him we went like to the same school and everything. I no no dick rider, no don't say I'm cloud chasing with this. But it's like it's very hard coming from where we're from to really like get out. You know what I'm saying? Like that's not that's my goal right now is to get out. So my the best advice I've received is never give up on your dreams y'all even if people hate on you they they try to troll you they try to bring out the negative energy in you just keep going do what you gotta do eliminate all the distract distractions and just do you for real don't let these people get to you so the next question would be what is your dream job my dream job is actually this right here content created making videos streaming on twitch if you don't follow me on twitch go follow me on twitch we be me and my friends we be lit on twitch every time we stream well we try to 
If you got any suggestions for what you want me to stream, come to Twitch. But my dream job is just content creating, just having fun, living life. You know, who would want to sit there and really just sit and work a nine to five, slaving for people when you can work for yourself, at work at your own pace. You can see the, the progress of your videos from the views, the likes. Like, isn't that to me? YouTube content creating is not really about money. It's just really about having fun and being able to do what you love for the rest of your life, for real. You know, that's that's my dream job. Just content creation as a whole, like YouTube, TikTok, Twitch, Instagram, Twitter, like just content creation as a whole, and to also meet new people. Like uh, content creation is lit. Um, the next question would be. What is the best thing about where you live? Now, the best thing about where I live, if you don't know, I'm from New York. I live in New York still. The best thing about New York is it really builds your character. Like, everybody is different from the next. You feel me? Everybody is different. You can be whoever you want to be in New York. You could be a fashion designer, hair stylist, nail tech, Basketball player, football player, photographer, like you could really be anything in New York. So I would say the best thing about where I live, it builds your character. It really provides you to be whoever you want to be in life. You feel me? It, you could do anything. Like me. Take me for instance. I love content creation. New York is very big. I could go, like, look, if you, for example, I would say my friend Show Out DJ. If y'all know my, my man Show Out DJ. Me and Show Out DJ started the same thing. We used to do Fortnite content post Fortnite. Now look at him. He's grown. He's big. He he the smoochy man. You know, smoochy man. Let me know if y'all want a smoochy exclude collab that you feel what I'm saying. But yeah, best thing about where I live is it builds your character. You can do whatever you want in life. Now the next question is, how long have you been doing content? I would say I've been doing content since, whoa. It really depends. I used to stream on Twitch, but I never took it seriously back when Call of Duty Advanced Warfare came out. I don't remember what year that was, but I used to stream back then. I used to post post Fortnite content on this channel back in like the OG Fortnite days, like before chapter before chapter one. It was just no, it was just season one. I used to post content back then, so I would say if. You, be talking about that it would be probably when for probably where fortnite chapter one came out or like og fortnite battle royale when it first dropped i think that was 2017 i think so this has been a while but i never actually like could stay consistent on posting youtube and streaming on twitch back then so the next question would be what the, is something you want to improve on Something I want to improve on is being so introverted. Like, I'm really closed in. I only stick to my group. But I feel like I have to be more extroverted with this type of, with the type of content I want to do. I have to really open up, like, let people in. Like, it's the same, like, it's the same, right? I could, like, actually, I don't know if it's the same or not, but I could let people in, but be very cautious of the people we're letting in me personally that's how i feel i just have to be more extroverted more out there more outgoing you know what i'm saying i'm more introverted i like to stay to myself stay to my group do my own thing but i feel like i have to be more extroverted that's something i need to work on being more out there you feel me so if you guys like the video you no know, give it a like 10k likes i will post another video tomorrow make sure you subscribe if you're new please subscribe i'm like road to 400 indeed 400 indeed please subscribe and comment what videos i want me to do next now i will see you guys next time peace